to the core, like these Lord Bagot goats, which, believe it or not, have inhabited our shores for many, many a year. This zoo for British wild animals is in the grounds of Ryber Castle near Matlock, Derbyshire. And if so is sheep, the last wild sheep in Britain, have eluded your nature walks, it's possible your children's children will be quite used to the sight of polecats. The zoo hopes to breed them in sufficient quantities to release a good many. Why, we can't think. Here too is the playpen of Tarka, the famous otter. He shares his pool with floating feathered friends, with geese and ducks. With matey mallards. With stately Huber swans, blue-blooded aristocrats that make a pond their province. For birds that sit and sing in trees, no zoo is needed. But the wise old eagle owl is a proud specimen, proud and strong. You'd be a twit to woo him. If you have bad dreams about mad bulls, you'll ride nightmares from now on. For Highland cattle are just about the wildest of Britain's wild animals. Forget elephants, Britain's largest wild animal is the red deer. Forget tigers, supreme British prize for sheer animal nastiness goes to the wildcat, for rarity to the pine martin. And in the comfort of his protective custody, here's one wild fox who can cheerfully forget hounds as well.